Welcome to the real Aberdeen. Or what Aberdeen is. One walks down West Market here. And one knows that Kurt walked the same streets of this port city, this port town. Thinking. And looking for answers. In a town that would have already been economically depressed in the 1980s due to the decline of logging And I think what's most inspiring to people all around the world that visit Aberdeen, Washington, is that it's a very run-down town. And it was when Kurt Cobain and Chris Novoselic grew up here, Buzz Osborne, other members of that Nirvana crew. And to come from this abject poverty on your way to becoming this cop right there. On your way to becoming the most important rock band ever since the Beatles. And sure, it was a different time when one could make it, quote-unquote, a little easier in the music industry. Pre-internet, there weren't so many options. You know, a lot of people make it who come from L.A. and places that are wealthy. Although, of course, L.A. has its really shitty areas too but a lot of people make it from well-established existing places as you walk through Aberdeen and everything is even more shut down and closed due to COVID, it's a real ghost town. And aside from me and some homeless people, there's no one walking around. A lot of empty spaces. Look at that. Let's go over there. I'm Ben. More police.
I'm just another looky loo with the phone. So, back to my earlier point. When you come from Aberdeen, Washington, there's only a couple success stories. Some football player I don't know, and Kurt Cobain. And it is the dream of every man to put the name of his hometown on the map. And Kurt Cobain did just that. He put his name on the map. And Aberdeen, Washington on the map. For better or for worse. So, this is going to end my time here in Aberdeen, as far as videos, probably. I don't know if I saw all the Nirvana and Kurt things, but for me, it was about getting a sense of the quietness of this town as I was going to bed last night you get the sense that there are a lot of secrets in Aberdeen a lot of violence behind closed doors and it's so quiet at night sometimes that it's creepy But even towns that are creepy at night seem promising during the day. And I get a lot of weird looks from people as I do this video. Driving by. I'm just yet another Nirvana and Kurt tourist. And you know that Aberdeen is sick of people like me. So with that, I want to thank you, the viewer, for watching this series on Aberdeen. And this has been Media Gita saying have a blessed day.